VBN, the Rich Video Blog Network, home to weekly NFL predictions, great personality profiles, great professional wrestling video blogs, great sports video blogs, great MBTA video blogs, great top 10 list of everything and anything video blogs, and a whole lot more. Collective my work goes back to June of 2000. 14 on various social media websites. RVB and the only video blog on the internet that matters. Time now is 6.24 in the morning, Bellwick, Massachusetts. It's Saturday, June 17, 2017. It's about 58 degrees in Bellwick, Massachusetts. It is going to be a cloudy and raw day. Hopefully some sunny breaks in the afternoon that could boost temperatures up into the lower 70s. Some news to report on the RVBN Newswire. Do, 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 do. The Boston Red Sox beat the Houston Astros by a score of 2 to 1 last night. It's Happy International Surfing Day. It's also Bunker Hill Day in Suffolk County in Massachusetts, that includes Boston, and Chelsea, and Revere, and Winthrop, and sad news to report in the world of Hollywood, director John Adelson, famous for directing the first Rocky movie, and The Karate Kid, passed away at the age of 81, so prayers to his family in this time. And that's about it on news from the RVBN News. Why do 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 be back in a flash with my first video blog subject of the day. But first, hear this. The Patel last week, no boss. Angelo gonna go to Market Basket today to scratch off millions of dollars of scratch tickets. He'll win nothing. Famous people only on RVBN. Time now, 6.25 in the morning, Bellwick, Massachusetts. Any suggestions for any future video blogs on RVBN? Private message me if you want a shout out or, or a plug for a friend who congr- did something amazing like uh, making a team or getting an A on a report card or engagements or weddings or births. Private message me. I am back. My first video blog subject of the day for Saturday, June 17, 2017 is my personality profile. Today's personality profile is Chicago Blackhawks right winger Patrick Kane. Patrick Kane's one of the top players in the National Hockey League right now. He is a, one of the best U.S born players of this generation. Patrick was born and he grew up in Buffalo, New York. He followed the Buffalo Sabres at an early age and he also started to play hockey when he was a youngster. He played on some junior teams, the Sabercats in Buffalo, which was like a like a youth hockey team sponsored by the Buffalo Sabres. He also played junior hockey in a like a hockey team in Detroit and he was pretty pretty awesome. Then he went north of the border to play for the London Knights of the Ontario Hockey League. He was a top player for the Knights and the Chicago Blackhawks drafted Patrick in the first round, the first overall pick in 2007, and he's been with the Chicago Blackhawks ever since. He's played all 10 seasons with the Blackhawks, and all 10 seasons he's been with the Blackhawks, he scored at least 20 or more goals. He's a great sniper. Four seasons he had 50 or more assists. Six seasons he had 70 or more points. He's played in six NHL All-Star games, two times. He's been named to the All-Star first team. He's won Stanley Cups in in 2010, 2013, and 2015. And one of those years, he's won the Conn Smite Trophy for Playoff MVP. 
He's also won a Ted Lindsay Award for the Players MVP. And he's won the Art Trust. Uh, last trophy for leading scorer in, uh, in the NHL, and he's won MVP. Patrick's the first U.S. born player in National Hockey League history to win the uh, last trophy and the con and the uh, and the uh, hot trophy as league's MVP, which is a pretty good feat because the NHL has been around a hundred years and they've never had a U.S. born player won the MVP until Patrick did. Patrick's part of a core of great um, Blackhawks players with Captain Jonathan Taze and defenseman Duncan Keith and Brett, Brent Seabrook and goaltender Corey Crawford. They form a great nucleus for the Blackhawks. They've won three Stanley Cups and they could be winning more in the near future. And when Patrick retires, he's probably going to have over 500 golds and a, over a thousand points. And his number 88 is going to be hanging from the Raptors at the United Center. And he's probably going to be our first ballot Hockey Hall of Famer. And Patrick's career stats so far are 285 goals, 467 assists for 752 points in the playoffs, 50 goals, 73 assists for 133 points. And that's about it on Patrick Kane. I'll be back later. Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and Google Plus with two more video blogs for your entertainment. First video blog will be about Pinehurst section of Bellica. Massachusetts and the third and final video blog of the night will be the top 10 list of everything and anything tonight. Tonight's top 10 list will be about the top 10 best Hanna-Barbera cartoons of all time. Keep calm everybody. I'm a Julie Benning guy. Molly Roseblood, WCC Rock Center's Nice Sex. Elizabeth Hatzel. So, so, He's the best. Amy Sweezy's awesome, awesome. Amy Linda Church of WPIX Channel of New York. Such a working crew cook. has got the best legs in New York City. Bun on. Bobby Gibbs of ABC London. Sweet Southern Accent. Best legs in Raleigh, North Carolina. Ren Claire of WHG Channel 7 in Boston. Has the best legs in Boston. And Ariel Woolley of WABI Channel 5 in ba Bangor, Maine. Rocks and has the best legs in Northern New England. Have a good day. Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and Google.